Is that we can in the device? Here we're using an electromagnet and we have a control circuit. Basically the, the magnet is controlled by the circuit and you have you have some sensors that you say if you look you see some words. These are four the sensors. And you have a on the other side you have a another sensor, but this is the actual this is the this is the um the, the emitter. This is the emitter, these are the collectors. So the ball is suspended between those just below those that like being which you cannot see because it, it is infrared. As the ball tries to rise up towards the magnet, it blocks the infrared signal. When you block the infrared signal, it causes the electronics to switch off the current to the electromagnet. But if you switch off the current to the electromagnet, the ball starts to fall. But as the ball falls, it also unblocks the infrared signal, and that tells the electronic circuit to switch back on the current to the electromagnet. And that actually brings back up the ball towards the but before the ball can actually touch the magnet, the magnet is switched off again, so the ball keeps on oscillating between a, a very fixed point. And that actually is what create the, the magnet levitation effect.